Hey there, Gemini. What's up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome in. Welcome back. This is going to be a general message. So take what fits and leave what doesn't. If none of this resonates for you, just try a different message. We're going to do a free for all today and just see what comes out for Gemini. Peace and thank you, Spirit. Interference. And release. Ooh. Okay. Anything else here or just those two? Okay. And retreat. When I see interference, I think of blockage. And when I think of blockage, I see a big boulder on like a path in the woods, right? But as soon as the release card came out, it's almost like you have a hammer or something and you just, you hit the boulder one time and it crumbles into like sand. And then retreat is like this blockage is just, it's retreating, you know? Um, so whatever you feel like the blockage is, I feel like it's so very simple for you to remove it. Now, normally when I think of blockages, I think of all the different mechanics that you have to use and leverage and whatnot um, with fallen branches to try and move this rock. But like for you guys, what I just got, it was so much simpler than I think I've ever imagined the boulder being moved. So... Whatever this blockage is, either the power is in your hands, right? The ball is in your court or um, no, that's got to be what it is. That's got to be what it is. Let's shuffle up and see where this goes. I feel like you have the means to remove whatever this blockage is. And it's about being smarter, you know, work smarter, not harder. With the Four of Pentacles, something you're holding on to here. Oh, this could be a physical item that you're you're holding on to. You have possession of. You might actually have to get rid of an item. So if you were gifted something by someone that did you wrong, did you dirty, brings up bad memories um, when you look at it. Or if it's like a, I don't know, it could be a kitchen utensil, right? Maybe it brings up bad memories when you use it in the kitchen. Like, replace it. Something needs to be released so that whatever this stagnant energy is, it can retreat. Three of Pentacles is speaking about building things, communities. It's also talking about mastership, mastering a skill or a trade or an art. King of Pentacles, mastership. Wow. All of these are Pentacles too. Yeah, you know, there is a spring cleaning itch going around and it looks like everybody's trying to scratch it. <laughs> High Priestess at the bottom of the deck. There's something that we're cleaning out here. This could even be um, old subscriptions that you're paying for. You're like, I never even use this whatever it is. Let's go ahead and cancel that subscription. This could even be paying something off. A car, a house, student loans. Wouldn't that be nice, right? <laughs> even the kitten agrees. Um, Kitty, speaking of the kitten, forgive her, she's new. <laughs> what have we got? 
Eight of Cups. Yeah, walking away from something here, releasing something. Or maybe it's trash day. Don't forget to take the trash out once you get all those items out of your house. Some of you guys aren't even putting them in your trash cans. Might be driving around and tossing them in a dumpster. Some of you might actually end up having a bonfire. I am literally getting pictures, photos. I'm also getting clothing. Feels like X's. I don't, not everybody understands how this stuff works. Maybe they left their stuff behind genuinely because they forgot it. Or maybe they left it behind and they thought you'd already thrown it away or whatever. Um, donated it or something, right? Some people do leave their stuff behind on purpose so they can keep a connection or so that it reminds you of them. Other times it's us holding on to things like photos that we've printed off or that we've still held on to instead of ripped up and thrown away. You know what I mean? You got to be really careful with that stuff because not only do you not know why they left it, but there could be a more sinister reason behind it. Some of these people know more about how this stuff works than they let on. Even if they're like, yeah, right, let me just leave him. I guess we'll find out, right? Even if they don't fully believe it, it can still work. Exactly, Six of Pentacles. This is about gifts as well. I feel like you're being compensated though. This blockage being removed is allowing new things to come in blessings to come in for some of you this is actually about a promotion at work some of you guys were just in denial that you could receive more something about qualifications look at that king of swords you absolutely qualify matter of fact you're exactly what we're looking for This is really thinking it through, too. At the bottom of the deck is the king of cups. Look at all these kings. What? Look at all these kings. Kings are mastership. This is also about your intuition, Gemini. And your heart. Some of you guys just have to believe in yourself here. Look at that, the Harrow font. This is your path. This was you investing in yourself. And I feel like the day has come where you see that pest, uh, investment really pay off. There's also this energy of I made it. Especially if you're paying off something big. I made it. I'm done. I no longer have to be stuck. I can move forward. There's a sense of freedom here as well as accomplishment. And you should be proud. You should celebrate. Even if it's just with your ancestors. Even if it's just going and getting an ice cream. It doesn't have to be something big and grand and whatever. But definitely celebrate this. Nothing else is coming out, so I think I'm going to leave it here. Yeah, your younger self also thanks you. And you're thanking your younger self, too. I love this. This is beautiful. If there's children involved, it looks like they're also benefiting from this. You're setting an amazing example. Even if they're not your children. You're the hero in somebody's story, and you might not even know it. We have Taurus, Cancer, Aquarius, Leo, and Taurus again. I'm going to leave it right here. I hope this message helps who it needs to, how it needs to. I love yous, and I'll see you soon. Until then, stay beautiful.